Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So this one is this last song is called "Cleared Away" or sorry, "Cleared Away" or "Fogabala." And uh, fo "Cleared Away" "Fogabala" was a war rallying cry of the Fighting 69th Brigade, um, a brigade that was set up by a man called Francis Marr. Mar of the Sword, he was called, he was from Waterford, and he was in another failed rebellion uh, in 1848, along with John Mitchell and William Smith O'Brien, and they were sent, they were gentlemen, and uh, they got kind of lenient treatment, kind of because of a general uproar around Ireland when they were caught, and uh, instead of life in uh, Van Diemen's Land, they got seven years. And But when they got there, they decided to escape, and after f one year, they dis they said, okay, we're going to escape. They had to give 24 hours notice before they escaped, apparently. <laughs> this is uh, true. <laughs> that um, in Mars journals, uh, not Mars journals, but John Mitchell's journals, like if, he, uh, if, there, if, you ever, if you're into that type of history, it's great, you know. He was a fantastic writer. And he, he explains how he was on his horse and... Uh, it was because of his pride, you know. He didn't want to escape and say that he, you know, because he was a gentleman, you know. If, until he said, you know, to the British government, I'm going to escape. So he ran in on his horse. He he got a, uh, he was on his horse. He he jumped off the horse, ran into the nearest constabulary office, and said, "I'm handing in my chit. I am going to escape now." <laughs> and ran out the door, hopped on his horse, and pegged off. <laughs> and. Uh, Things were already set up for him, so he went land, got onto a, um, a, a ship, ended up in Knoxville, and uh, close to where I am. And uh, he was an avid supporter of the South. Mar was uh, an avid supporter of the North. And uh, so, anyway, Mar set up the brigade. They fought many a battle, and the last two were Fredericksburg and Antietam. And in Fredericksburg, they were climbing up a height. You know, it had to, it, they had to charge this height, and on the top of it were. Macmillan's rebels, who were about 80% naturalised Irish themselves, and uh, the Irish Brigade were as well, you know. 3,000 men went up the hill, 300 came down. So much so, it was such a disaster that uh, the, the brigade was disbanded. And uh, Marr got delusioned with the war, the disillusioned with the war, and ended up becoming the governor of Montana. <laughs> and uh, he... Fell off a riverboat. He fell off a riverboat, exactly. <laughs> and because he had some gambling debts apparently <laughs> <laughs> so an ignominious end to our Francis Marr but <laughs> and there was no woman to save him <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so thanks very much again and uh, Sight all around me, dusted blue and fading grey. Men in heaps were scattered, men who fought and died the other day. I lived my youth in Connemara, roving from town to town. I shipped on board of the Amelia to New York City, I was bound. Not for honor, nor for country We kill for three square meals a day Off the boat and pack on the shoulder Gun in hand, we're here to stay At Fredericksburg we rose to meet them Though we knew the price we'd pay But the Irish Brigade will not surrender Fog about it, cleared away General Marr, he gave the order Up Mary's Heights, charge away The hills were rife with blood and murder As we gouged and tore our way Macmillan's rebels, they fired upon us Shot and shell, book and wall Their green flag rose high above them 
as ours fell on the battle wall. At Fredericksburg we rose to meet them, though we knew the price we'd pay. But the Irish Brigade will not surrender, fog of Allah cleared away. Face to face there, a young rebel, he charged me in the fray. I turned around and my blade went through him. I did the devil's work that day. For I saw my face there before me, in the boy that I hewed down. He could have been a friend or brother, another exile from my town. and strong rose to fight them in Antietam's ripening corn. But Fredericksburg was our undoing, 300 left to weep and mourn. At Fredericksburg we rose to meet them, though we knew the price we'd pay. But the Irish Brigade will not surrender, fog and water cleared away. At Fredericksburg we rose to meet them, though we knew the price we'd pay. But the Irish Brigade will not surrender, fog of honor cleared away, fog of honor cleared away. Thank you, Leo Thank you.